Hi, I'm here with Eric. How are you today, Eric? I'm fine, thank you. Could you tell me about your experience in the life of a yogi teacher training program with Sri Dharma Mitra? Well, I did the 200 hour training in 2007, and I, I went into it to sort of deepen my practice in more or less of a selfish way, but it ended up really opening me up in a lot of ways and realigning a lot of things in my life that had drifted out of alignment over the years of, of um, you know, that, that my practice has helped me to put back in alignment. And then I followed that up the next year with a 500 hour and uh, continued just immersed myself in teaching for six years and um, you know my life has just never been the same it's been you know he's you know dharma has helped me guided me along the way he's taught me music he's taught me about my diet he's taught me a lot about myself and uh, you know I'll forever in his debt for that oh that's wonderful to hear and you were also part of um, mentoring some of the training programs how was that for yes, you yes that was that was in a way more challenging than doing the actual training mm. uh, because you, I felt like I didn't have the, the leeway to go one way or another. I had to pretty much go straight down, straight down the line, if that makes any sense. Um, and it was, it just helped to reaffirm. Uh, it was like doing a refresher course for me every time I, I mentor. And uh, it's been just quite an amazing experience. Thank you, thank you so much, Eric, for carrying on this lineage. <laughs> You're welcome. I am here with Andrea. Andrea, tell me what it's been like coming to the Dharma Yoga Center in New York City in preparation for the Life of a Yogi teacher training program you're doing in the fall. It has been really amazing. I practice here like five times, six times per week, as much as I can, and it has really changed my life in a very positive way. I would say the lifestyle of preparing for the 500 hour and following Dharma's teachings has created great balance within me, and it's something I practice really uh, as much as often as I can. But I changed my diet to a vegetarian diet, and then eventually became a vegan, and that is really helping my practice because I feel more flexible, my body is opening a little bit more, my mind is clear, and it has helped me a lot with pranayama. Because I had problems breathing, and I'm, I still have it a little bit, but once I got rid of dairy, so much better. I know it sounds kind of, kind of funny, but it's true. Like you, you gotta try it. Dairy really, uh, if you have sinus issues and stuff, if you get rid of dairy, it will definitely help, for sure. That's great. I'm so excited for your journey and thank you so much for these words. <laughs> thank you. <laughs>